The SFU Clan Track and Field teams will be in action this weekend at the 2014 GNAC Outdoor Track and Field Championships meets in Monmouth, Oregon, ahead of the NCAA Championships the following weekend. Cameron Proseviat, who recently earned an NCAA professional standard in the 800 meter, will use this meet to get closer to the automatic standard. I'm going in with confidence actually. Um, the last couple GNAC championships I was a little nervous going in and I realized after that I didn't have too much to worry about. And I really think if I go into confidence into the, the prelims, it shouldn't be a problem getting into a finals and then just race in the finals like I've been doing lately. And really I just need to go out harder than I usually do in the races and hold on. Knowing what's on the line, freshman Natasha Kianipour, Ella Brown, Joe Webster and Daniel Kellaway are also preparing themselves for the conference championships and to put themselves in a better position to reach the NCAAs. I'm just trying to stay really calm and focused. I mean, we had a meet last weekend and it went pretty well, so that's a good confidence booster. Uh, well, we're kind of taking it easy this week. We both got a lot of races this weekend, so it'll be tough. But the main thing is just to rest up before the weekend. Just make sure we're at our best. Staying relaxed before my races, I think that's most important. And you know, for the 4x1, I mean, we just had practice and we're feeling really confident going in. You know, we can really improve on our time, so that's really exciting. Taking it easy, trying to keep relaxed, so then when we come to our finals, it'll be much, we can have a little bit of energy left, because our finals seem to be, they look like they're gonna be really tough for us, so we got a lot of work out for us. It's a really competitive field, so just, you know, giving it your 100%, you know, during heats and during finals, that's all you can do. James Young, who currently have an NCAA provisional standard in the 1500 meter, and Sarah Sawatsky, who is just 0.15 seconds off the NCAA automatic mark in the 800 meter, will be going out hard and running strong this weekend. Definitely just got to go out uh, hard like I did the last time I ran provisional and just finish a little bit faster. It's a championship race, so you're obviously going for the win, but uh, if I can get just a little bit faster, I'd be really happy. Honestly, I just want to run strong this weekend. Um, I'm not too concerned about the time. I'm just, I want to be in there and ready to go. And as seniors, it will mean everything to them to win GNAX and qualify for nationals. It would be a good way to end. I'd be really happy with that. It would mean everything to me to either win GNAX or to, or both, to qualify for nationals also. Here is head coach Britt Townsend on her team's preparations and her goals for the weekend. We're tapering this week and, and um, you know, building confidence, making sure they're rested, doing all the recovery things that they need to do, and, uh, and so that they're mentally fresh to enter this meet to do the best that they can. Preparation has been going on all the way through the season um, by letting them compete and, and giving them opportunities at high-level meets and see how they compare to other people and we have more GNAC qualifiers this year than any other year. To find out more information on the SFU clan track and field teams and the GNAC conference championships visit athletics.sfu.ca. For SFU Athletics, I'm Gabriel Lynn.